What up, YouTube? It's David. It's Hunter. We're back at it again. E Chill Talk Session 24. Yeah. Happy we, to be back. Yeah, happy to be here. Happy to be making content for you guys. You already know what it is. Yeah. So, uh... We always make the video in this car. People probably think we live in it. <laughs> yeah, for real, but we don't. <laughs> but this is just our right area. Yeah. But, um... We just like to make the videos in the car, you know yep. what I mean? It's, it's just a tradition at this point, but, yeah, um... Honestly. Hell yeah. Um... Basically, I, I figured what we'd talk about there with you guys today is Kobe Bryant. This is Chill Talk session number 24. Yeah. So his number Kobe's was number. 8 and 24. Yeah. So basically, we're just going to sum up his career from to the time that he got number 24 to the time that he retired. Yeah. Basically, when he got number 24, he was stepping into that legend phase. Like the... the <laughs> I don't yeah. know the backstory behind why he switched actually switched his number. I don't know. But either. it just feels like from when he went from eight to twenty four, he his level also went from like eight to twenty four. Yeah. Like he he yeah. stepped it up and he fucking won ships. He he also won ships Does with eight <clears throat> too, but I, I feel like him himself personally, he stepped it up. And he got shit done. Does it? He, he, he was for a while, from like 2008 to like 2012, he was the greatest player in the world. And then he got injured and it started declining. And yeah. yeah. But doesn't, he, doesn't he only have one MVP? Uh, I don't know how many he actually has. I think has. he has one, too. Which is surprising, honestly. Yeah, he, I thought he would have more. He was a really good player. It's just like, I don't know. Yeah. I, we're Kobe fans, obviously. obviously. Uh, we've been Lakers fans since, like, the beginning. So yeah, anybody that much. says that we're LeBron bandwagoning is completely incorrect because we've been here since, you know, way before LeBron even. Since I was, like, fucking... Yeah, since, since like, like 2000 years. fucking eight. I've been Lakers, rocking with the like, Lakers since, like, I was, like, seven years old. Yeah, like it's it's been, it's been a long time, years, dude. you know. And I never thought LeBron would have went to the Lakers, but you know he did. I never thought that. And that's happened. his, you know. He he went to the Lakers ten years too dude. late, man. Dude, if if he went to the Lakers in two thousand nine with Kobe, oh my they would have been unstoppable. Yeah, everybody would have wanted to go to the Lakers too. They would have been. And they would have created a dynasty probably better than the Warriors. Yeah. Exactly. That's, That's absolutely crazy. That if if they joined forces together, that would have been the greatest team ever. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, LeBron has his downsides and Kobe has his downsides, but like they are so tremendously skilled that together when they play good and their t team chemistry per se would be good. Yeah. Then you know they would play at an alarming pace yeah. like they would be squaring the ball and just them both they're insanely good dunkers and they're mm -hmm. insanely athletic and they both play decent defense besides lebron recently mm -hmm. and kuzma having to shove him towards um <laughs> yeah, that's funny, it's a, to play defense um i mean you know if you're the star of the lakers and you're the greatest of like this generation like the last five six seven years say you're the greatest player i mean I mean, yeah, you came back from a 3-1 fucking deficit Yeah. at that the Warriors sick. in the, what, 2016? That, that, that was crazy. I remember when that yeah. happened. But I just feel like... <laughs> he can't do it himself. Like, nah. He couldn't do what Kobe did. Let's just say that. Like, At least Kobe had, like, Pau Gasol, though. Yeah, Kobe had, like, someone, like, really good. Yeah, like, old Derek Fisher. Yeah. 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 That's what he had, and they're really good players. They've been, they've been playing together for a long time. Yeah. And just crazy. You know? But, um, yeah. I compared to LeBron, he just needs to get his shit in gear. He needs to go playoff mode. Yeah. I wonder if they're going to tank this season, though. I mean, if they keep losing, yeah. Like, if they lose, like, another five games, then they're done. Yeah. Then they're, then they're sure. going to be ten games behind. Yeah. And they would have to win, like, every game. Yeah. And they're 
schedule is pretty hard, so I don't see them. They have to start winning games. Like, if they won five in a row, mm-hmm. their their chances of being back in the playoffs would be a lot. But if they, like, go, like, two and three, then they're basically done. Yeah. Like, they have to win it all, and they have to win now. Mm-hmm. They have to step up their shit right now. It's it's March. We yeah. only have, like, a month and a half left. Before the season's done. Season is almost over. Yeah, it's March, ladies and gentlemen. Like that gotta open your eyes and realize that LeBron even LeBron can't like recover this Lakers team. Like I've followed the Lakers and I love the Lakers and they've been tanking it and I've just been hoping I hope that LeBron could have brought them Dude. to the playoffs for a season, but I wasn't expecting anything. Dude. But from from my like view from it like if they're tanking on purpose to get a good pick via Zion Williamson that would be crazy yeah but what position is Zion he's small four LeBron could be at the four LeBron could also run Ingram can be at the two LeBron could run the point yeah LeBron could run the point that's true that that would be crazy, but I would be a point forward. If if they actually don't make the playoffs this season, I'm gonna be kind of depressed because oh, I I real. wanted to like see them in the playoffs. Like I wanted to like be excited about the NBA playoffs. Yeah. Like I haven't been because it's just been uh, Cleveland and um, Golden State Warriors. Cleveland and Golden State Warriors. It's been like this for like the last five or six years, and well, not that long, but feels like 20 but there's there needs to be an equal balance of power yes between Mm -hmm. and I just feel like if the Golden State Warriors split up maybe that wouldn't be a bad thing but yet again they won't Mm -hmm. so that means teams have to build to beat the Golden State Warriors that's that's what the NBA is doing right now. That's what all the other teams are trying to do. Beat the Golden State Warriors. Mm-hmm. Make the playoffs. Just that's, make the playoffs. Yeah. Make the playoffs and beat the Golden State Warriors. That's like that's what they have to do to win a championship. That's why they are playing to try to win a championship. Like, yeah, <clears throat> Yes, sir. It differs from opinion to just being there and experiencing it. And, you know, mm-hmm. I find that it's your own opinion, but... Still, if for sure, if you're gonna if you're gonna build a winning team, yeah, then it's gonna take some time. You can't sign multiple large. Well, unless you have cap space, you can't sign multiple large contracts per year. What it take us to eight years? Yeah, it's simulating. Yeah, and it took us eight years to make a great team. Yeah, and we're not even making playoffs. As of right now, we aren't. We won 82 and 0. Statistically, we will not make the playoffs this year. Yeah. You know, if if we make 8th, it's going to be the skin of our teeth, and we're probably going to go out first round because, hey, it's going to be the Golden State Warriors. They're probably. Knocking on the door. Yeah. Saying. You know, or. Or. LeBron beats them in the first round. That'd be. And and makes an insane comeback. Or not even, maybe it blows them out. Maybe, maybe this is all staged in anticipation for something huge. Yeah. Who knows? Who maybe, knows? Maybe the NBA is rigged. Probably not. Uh, probably probably not. not. It's just a like but theory. Like maybe. It's just a question to stir always up. Some, yep. Always something to stir up the pot. Yeah. <laughs> you know, maybe, maybe it is rigged. Maybe it's not. Who knows? Yeah. You know. But let's just look at, at it from our standpoint is yes. If they don't win, they're they're not going to make the playoffs. If they don't make the playoffs, they're going to get a good pick. If they get a decently good pick like top 10, they're not going to get Zion because he's going to go first. Yeah. Unless sure. unless somebody else they goes could get first. Um, 
they, Andre they, Barrett. They, from this draft class alone, they're top ten. He, they're going to get a really, like, decent player. Like, yeah. Lakers always have, for the last couple of years, they've been getting, what, top three. That's what the Lakers have been yeah. getting because Got they Ingram. have been tanking this, Ingram, this season. Kuzma, Lonzo. Kuzma was a second-round pick. Yeah. Like, he was a steal. Like I'm just saying all the picks they've gotten. Like, even that's, that's you like know. Like, since the tanking. Is... You know, everybody says, oh, second-round picks are trash. But, like, Kuzma. Yeah. Great example. Like, second-round pick. Like, plenty of potential. Mm-hmm. Just overlooked. Yep. You know? Straight up. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of funny how they overlooked him now. Dude, you know who? I forgot who Damian Lillard was compared to on his draft stock, but it was like some like weird point guard that wasn't very good at shooting, but could pass. Yep. And he was compared to Damian Lillard, or Damian Lillard was compared to him. Yep. And Damian Lillard is like a shoot, like a superstar now. Yeah. Pretty much. But basically, that just sums he, it up for what he we doesn't want to sell himself you. out though talk to you guys about but uh if you like this shit remember to like and subscribe check out all our other videos we just came out with a fortnite video we're probably be gonna be uh <laughs> we're probably are going to be posting another video of fortnite tonight on youtube and Instagram. probably probably la noir too and, and la noir we're probably gonna come out with a little snippet of uh us gameplay trucking through an oil field yep basically that yeah but um yeah, so we'll see you guys soon. David and Hunter out. Peace.